Do it! My name is Henrik and this is my younger brother David. Hey! David, what are we up to today? Recreating the Mythbusters episode where they try to make a compact car disappear. Mm -hmm. They take two lorries, lo lorries, la la lorries, trucks. trucks, and they smush them together and they have a compact car, a small car in the middle, and the myth is that it disappears. Oh, it's gonna work! Are they gonna hit at the same time? And there's no sign of the car. <laughs> A very compact compact. I still see the car. Not looking too good for the myth. So they try to recreate the result. They take a rocket sled out into the desert, a big metal plate propelled by these huge rockets, and it accelerates up to the speed of sound and then smushes the car. an opportunity to crunch the crucial numbers, Adam and Jamie check out the aptly named high speed footage. So we're gonna recreate exactly that and we're gonna do it with a Lego car. Da! This is a Lego Porsche 911 GT3 and it's absolutely gorgeous. It has a lot of moving and functioning parts. You have doors with hinges. You can turn the wheels. I don't, I'm not gonna do that because it's gonna fall off. It has a working gearbox, which you can put into drive, neutral, and reverse. And it has a functioning gear system underneath, so it's four gears for each gear. And it even has the hood trunk, or the hunk, as we call it, with a toolbox. So you can fix the car when it breaks down. It's actually not a toolbox, it's just a handbag. <laughs> Is this a handbag? <laughs> yeah, it's so oh, when you're it's going got leather straps on it, yeah. So this is for luggage, hood luggage, huggage. We even have a, a camera holder that David oh, yeah. built. If you see footage from this, it means that it survived the crash. So hopefully it safely ejects in the crash. So this is our version of uh, the Mythbusters rocket sled. We have a wood plate because it's uh, a lot easier to make. So I just laser cut this. We have a rocket on here, which I've turned on the lathe. And for maximum viewing pleasure, we put a camera on it. This is propelled by... This. This is the propellant, the fuel. So it's basically cow shit that David boils in a pot and then he adds sugar, spice and the chemical X. <laughs> that always made me wonder, <laughs> like, why did the professor make children in his basement? <laughs> like, it's, it's just weird. The Mythbusters, their uh, sled goes 700 miles an hour, which is faster than the speed of sound. Ours is going... 1200,000 kilometers per second. Yes, it's very accurate. This is easily the most nervous I've been shooting an episode. There's so many things that can go wrong, like the, the fuel can explode. Oh, wow. <laughs> the fuel burns too fast and the drag from the smusher just makes it like, fall Jesus. off, break the sled, or the fuel might burn too slowly and we get smoke everywhere, or the car just falls off before we get there or during the initial smushing. So I really hope everything goes all right. Okay, let's recreate some Mythbusters, make some science. Let's do it. Okay, this is recreating Mythbusters vanishing car with a Lego car in three, two, one. Oh, oh my god, this hurts it, my soul! It hurts! Oh! It hurts so much! Oh, it doesn't look like a lot of the, the pieces are damaged! No, they're not! It's fine! We can collect them and rebuild it! Actually, yeah, I think so! This is the big part! Oh, the camera survived! Oh, nice! Is the it, camera survived? Yes! Camera still... Is it recording? Please tell me it's recording! Yes! It's blinking! Got it! Yes! But look, oh. you can even see all the gears! So you can see how this works. Yeah, now you can see what we were talking about. It's a gearbox. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh, it was, that was so... was like a 
Oh big my gosh. Lego explosion of pieces. It's gonna look so amazing in the slow mo. Oh, it has to. There's pieces everywhere. It looks like a battlefield. This was exactly like the Mythbusters episode, <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> Um, we can build, rebuild our car though. They yeah, can't. They can't. I'm refusing to give this car up. I'm gonna find every last piece and we're gonna rebuild it. Heck yeah! Oh, Let's watch the slow mo, freaking slow mo! Slow -mo. It's, uh, I'm gonna grab a bear berry. Remember Lego? Mm. I remember. Remember Stodupet? Oh! 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 So beautiful! That was insane! Oh, rewind it! Rewind it! Oh, it's just... Oh, it's beautiful! It stays in place and it just... Ah, uh, just pushes yeah. it! It has so much mass, it just... <laughs> ah, straight into the back and it just... It pushes it forward and it becomes more and more compact until it just... Yeah, it's like it. Yeah. And then it's like halfway and then it's just pieces starting going everywhere. Explodes. Reminds me a lot of the Mythbusters episode. Yeah, it does. So we've kept you waiting long enough. Let's get down to business. In three, two, one. Wow! Whoa! Now that was fast. Really, really fast. Incredibly, the spectacle of the launch is matched wow. by the destruction of the rocket's destination. Wow, that's a, a lot flatter than the one out on the runway. <laughs> I wouldn't exactly call it flat, it's more like shrapnel. For an encore of all. Holy crap, this is eating far. And an opportunity to crunch the crucial numbers, Adam and Jamie check out the aptly named high speed footage. That didn't mess around. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, Aww. it's heartbreaking, but it's beautiful. Sylvia's reactions are always priceless. <laughs> yes, they are. Oh. Oh, oh. Cool. Broke. I've slowed this footage down so we can see frame by frame what's going on. It's really interesting when the smusher hits the car and you can see the energy going through the car into the back plate. I think we were incredibly lucky getting this footage. As you can see the smasher tilts backwards but it still squishes the whole car in a really nice way. Here I'll jump back. Look at the front wheel of the Porsche moving backwards being compressed before finally about halfway there flying out sideways. There is so much force in this impact it's crazy. I'm so glad that we got this footage. It just looks freaking amazing. That's a lot of pieces. Uh, it was amazing. I love this episode. It did turn out like more or less like the Mythbusters episode. Yeah, it did. The acceleration was perfect. It hit it, it didn't fly off, break off. The drag worked. It squashed the car like straight on. Everything just worked. It was beautiful. Yeah. Oh, time to salvage the parts. Sylvia promised us that she would rebuild it later. Yeah. Um, of course. <laughs> I have the uh, manual, so Thank it's you. fine. We actually managed to rebuild the car. I only needed to get a few spare parts. Otherwise, it was completely fine. I want to thank Stephen Moses for funding this episode. Thanks. You're awesome. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs>